Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am doing my 18th birthday look. We're about to go out and party hard. And if you want to see how I created this look, just keep watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. Okay guys, so the first thing you wanna make sure of is that you clean your face before you start your makeup and that your makeup brushes are clean because you don't wanna get acne or any stuff like that. That's bad for your skin, so just clean your freaking face. <laughs> <laughs> really nigga so the first thing that I'm going to do is prime my face with the Armani Prima from let's do that just a few pumps that should be fine I dot it all over my face till all the product is gone and then I just massage it massage it into my face I also prime my face on the neck. <coughs> what? That doesn't make any sense. Oh. Second step is the foundation. Just put a few pumps on my hand that I think that I'll be needing. That should be good. I just use my fingers and dot that all over my face too. Like so. Next we're taking the beauty blender and we're just gonna Beat everything and blend everything out. This foundation is like way brighter than my face because of summer. And I got a little tan. <gasps> beat that face! Okay. Okay, so I think everything is blended out pretty well. Okay, so next up that we're doing is the contour part. For the contour part, I am using the Contour Cream Kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills in medium. Taking what you need and then you apply a triangle kind of thing under your eyes and put it like at the start of your nose because it makes your nose look slimmer in the end. Contour part, I am using this color. What is this color called? Cinnamon. And I just take what I need and contour. Contour areas. Whoop, 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 and whoop. Jawline. I love sharp jawline, so you know, I always try get the sharpest jawline I can get. Then I contour a little under my lip because I really have such small lips and I always try to make them look like, try to make them look bigger. So yeah, I overline my lips, I contour my lips because I want them to be big. That looks horrible, but that's fine. I'm just gonna blend that out. I can't get my life together. Okay, so time to blend everything out again. Do it. Oh, for my lip area, I use a small beauty blender because I want to be cool. You can use a big one too, but I think, I don't know, I feel more pro when I use do this, you know? Like sometimes I also use the small one for my nose and I just feel so professional. For the rest of my contour parts, I use a blending brush. It's from Zoeva. It'll be in the description box below. I'm gonna keep everything sharp here. Yeah. Oh, next, I am using my NYX powder contour. What is this palette called? My NYX Highlight and Contour Pro Palette. Everyone kind of has this palette and everyone has it because it's dope and you guys know it. I bought this palette like a year ago and like it's, look how good it is except the highlighter but like it doesn't finish fast, it's not expensive and I fell in love with it. You know, I'm a, I'm a YouTuber now. Use it 
use the code Sydney and get 20% discount. No, not that far yet, but someday. I am using this brush with this. What is this brush called? Luxy large angle brush in number 504. I'm using the colors. What are these colors called? Uh, 07. Is it 07? Yes, yeah, 07 and 08. Sorry, I'm just mixing, mixing. And I'll use this one too. Okay, so starting at my ear. And then I'll go like this little. And then I dab myself up. I really like to dab. I hope you got the joke. Okay, so using the same colors again. I am going to define my jawline. Like so. Just like this. And now I blend. Because you know this line is not okay. So you blend. Same colors again. You tap the axis off like so. Oh my gosh, I hope I don't f now we're just blending. Okie dokie. Now highlighting area. I am mixing these two highlighting powders. <laughs> Guys, one year, but now it's over. <laughs> I can fix it. <gasps> I can't. Okay, continue. <laughs> We're not just. <laughs> we tap the axis off. Can you see it? I can see the axis. Okay. And then you just dab. And, I dab. and you dab your highlight areas, like so. Same thing again on the other side. You take both colors, tap the axis off, and then you dab. This video is going to be everything except professional. I take a big blending brush. This is from Sephora. The Pro Crease uh, number 10. I take the same colors again and highlight my nose. Like so. No. I forgot. You have to go back to this brush that we used before and contour my lips quick break I need to pee <laughs> I'm back oh shit that actually hurt let's continue I am going to put my bake on I use the Prep and Prime from MAC and this black beauty blender. It's the stark is my soul. You just dab into it, you know, because we keep dabbing. And you just do this on your highlight areas. My nose. Whoop. Yes. Okay, so for my eyebrows, I am using this little cute brush from Sephora a pro brow uh, number 20 and I am going to use my brow gel today from from Mac in the color deep dark brunette I know that's not my eyebrow color but I like my eyebrows to be dark so fix my brows and they didn't really go work well today but you know that's fine shit happens I am using the ST Lauder brow now it's a really small tube I think it was a tester or something how I got it I don't remember but I just found it in my makeup bag and since then I keep using it 
So let's fix our brows. Okie dokie. Okay, so we're starting with the eyes. I am using a little translucent powder so the blending will be easier. Just dab it here. Dab it here. And then just quickly blend it. Okay, today's look I am using the Naked 3 palette because it has like a lot of rose and gold colors what I find really pretty and yeah let's get going the first color that I'm using is Limit and I just apply that all over my eyelid kind of be using a smaller blending brush and I am taking the color Nooner and apply that to my crease putting those two together tap the excess off and going back into my crease. And okay, when this is all blended out, now I will be using the NYX palette again. Use the same color that we used before. And I will just apply the concealer all over my eyelid here. Then I will be using my small beauty blender and just dab that. And I will be taking a smaller brush. Take the color Trick and put this on the outer corner of my eyelid. using the naked two I will take the color just take a little tap the excess powder off and put this on the outer corner of my eye under my eye I will be using the naked three again with a small blending brush and apply this under my eye So much product just for the eyeliner. Just put that on my waterline up here. Before, after, <laughs> but I'm not done yet. <laughs> so, for the lashes, I am using a lash primer from Estee Lauder, little black primer, and I will be using which mascara? Will, I'll just use the Mac False Lashes today. False, false, false lashes. Yeah. So first, we're gonna prime the lashes. Then. I'm gonna be mascara on the lashes. Okay, guys, I am using the. Woo, you know, everyone does this. I am using the Huda Beauty lashes in. Camel? Camel? Camille? I am using the glue from MAC, the Duo Glue. I'll just apply that on the tip of the lashes, a very thin layer. And then I'm gonna wait 30 seconds and like almost close my eyes and then you know you just put as close to your lash line as possible so I'll try to do that this is the first time I'm actually wearing them 
They look cute. They're fine. Let me remove my bake while I'm waiting. Okay, for my blush, I am using the Estee Lauder Pure Color and Resculpting Blush. <laughs> that was so weird. Okay, top the access powder off and then, you know, you just smile. Get that along your cheekbone. Our side. I look like a drag queen right now. <laughs> well, you really want to make sure when you're applying lashes is that you're applying them as close to your lash line as possible. Then I, you know, put it in the correct place. I try let it dry a little. And then I squeeze my false lashes with my real lashes like together. And that's kind of how I'm doing it. Okay. For the highlighting part, I am using the Urban Decay Naked Illuminated Highlighter in the color Aura. And I just apply that on my cheekbone. And then I am also taking this. Oh no, for fing <laughs> What? I take everything back, people. Don't buy this palette. I am giving up on life. Taking this highlighter. <laughs> and you know, I just applied that on my cheekbone again. <laughs> Holy shit, what a day. Here, and here. And under my eyebrows. You mind it wasn't recording this whole time? Uh, I'd say I'm literally giving up on life right now, but I already gave up, so you know. <sighs> We're good! Oh, my lips are gonna take them the time. You're so done with the tutorial. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, last but not least, that's how you say it lips. Uh, to prime my lips, I'm taking the Prep and Prime Lip Primer. And I leave the foundation and like the concealer on my lips because my lipstick lasts like double the time when I do that. I do not remove it. Thanks for watching. If you're still watching this, thank you so much for keeping up with my bull rule. I should really do a giveaway, but I'm too broke for that. <laughs> no, people, you're doing a great job. And if you're like skipping forward, that's cheating. I mean like the people are watching through it. If you actually watch through it, then please write in the comments below that you're also awesome. You're awesome. What, what, what lipstick am I using today? I didn't think that far. You know what? I'll just use this pretty little, where did it go? Lip gloss. Where's it from? Estee Lauder and the color. Copper Ego. Okay. Okay. What you gonna do with the dessert? Eat it. <laughs> Obviously. Alrighty. Ta -da. I will do my hair now and then I'll be back. So. My gay friend just asked me, she's like, is she single? Alright guys, so that was it with my makeup tutorial. I am going out and party now. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If so, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and see you next time.